welcome back to my learning block. All right, you're here because your child is now learning how to read and you're excited and I'm excited and we're excited and we'll be excited together, but we'll even be more excited when we get to the back end of this process. But you're here because we're learning how to read because of through phonemic awareness. Sorry, words getting caught up. So learning through phonemic awareness. And as you know, phonemic awareness is understanding phonemes, which are the smallest unit of sound. It is it, it's creating an understanding of the building blocks of words. Phonemes, uh, it, it's truly important. And if you ever hear someone say sound it out to a child, then they're basically implying that that child has learned through phonics or phonemic awareness, however you want to call it, they've learned through the sounds of words. And so in order to do this, you have to first understand what these sounds are. Um, and so you're here at this video because you want to learn the sounds of B, D, and C. Now, I will tell you this, for the purpose of this process, please, do not teach your child the alphabet song. It's not gonna help. All right, so let's focus on understanding these words or these letters through their phonemic sounds. Um, the first sound we have goes with, as you see the illustration, a bed. And the sound is B. Simple B. B like bed. Next, we have k, k, like cat. And then finally, we have d, d, like dog. So again, the, the phonemic sounds, we have b, b, like bed. We have k, k, like cat. And then we have d, d, like dog. Now it's important that when you're introducing these sounds to your child, allow them to see the letter, to hear the sound, and if they have the opportunity to see your lips, see how your mouth moves in order to create these sounds. That's very important and it'll help out when the time comes to blend these sounds together. Again, thank you for joining me on my learning block. See you next time. Keep learning.